Hi, Terry W. with another Verberator Minute. This time, let's discuss infinitives. So let's go over here to the verb tense selection and select infinitive. In English, infinitives are the word to, T-O, followed by a verb, to walk, to run, to have, to do anything. And in Spanish, they happen to be a single word with uh, an ending of AR or ER or IR. All Spanish infinitives will have one of those three endings. And let's see. Infinitives are to your advantage to learn because you can use them in, in many practical sentences. If you know how to say, I want something or, or yo quiero and put that in front of the infinitive, you then have uh, I want to run, I want to do, I want to have something. If you put tengo que or I, I have to in Spanish in front of an infinitive, I have to wake up early tomorrow, I have to leave in a half hour, um, you can do all kinds of things like that with the infinitive. And all you have to, uh, you don't have to conjugate the infinitive in those kind of sentences. So let's take a look right now. Let's pick a verb. We could go into the custom verb selection and pick a, a specific one. Let's instead look at irregular verbs for a change and let's select, and again, these move by five at a time and then you can do a specific set of five in, in succeeding order or if you want the first 35, the first 40, etc. So let's do the 15th set of five. Let's go lucky 13. There's a good one. Okay, and here they are. You can see I played with them before. Let's uncheck the verbs in the queue. Also down here is the, uh, the sound level. Okay, we are just about ready. We have our delay set on one second, really low, and two, light. Encender. That's the... To. Confine. Spanish. Encerrar. Infinitive. To. Find. Encontrar. Okay, you get the idea there. Let's use the phrase maker. To. Light. The match. Encender. El cerillo. To. Confine. The dog to the basement. <sighs> Encerrar. Al perro en el sótano. To find the treasure. Encontrar. Okay. Now, let's change it to the to be going plus infinitive. Since you will have practiced those and learned the infinitives, if you know how to conjugate the verb for to go in Spanish or ir, I-R, you can, well, let's see. Let's keep it simple and say only the he conjugation for he does all these things. In this case, uh, to be going for one person is el ba a. So, uh, well, let's see. He is going to light the match. El va a encender el cerillo. Uh, pause it. So you know it's always, he is going to is always el ba a. So he's going to do something. In this case, you'll, you'll have learned the infinitive for to light. So it's very helpful in those cases as well. He is going to confine the dog to the basement. Él va a encerrar al perro en el sótano. Okay, let's go crazy he, here. He is going to go crazy sometimes. Él va a enloquecer a veces. Okay. So that's a little bit about infinitives and uh, using this form of to be going plus infinitive. Uh, hopefully uh, you can see how practical this can be and using Verberator to practice all this stuff can really help. This has been another Verberator Minute. I'll see you next time.